very much for this special recognition. There were 12 of the London children, and so growing up, we had lots of aunts and uncles and bunches of cousins. And here tonight, we have 12 first cousins, 10 second cousins, and one third cousin. And with their families, we have a total of 36 who are celebrating the London heritage. And we're pleased that they could all be with us. Of the 12 children, we are blessed to still have Uncle T.L., who is 96 and a half years young. <laughs> In fact, if you've been to the senior citizens lately, you've seen him dancing up a storm. <laughs> so I'm going to turn it over to Uncle T.L., and he's likely to sh uh, share a story or two and maybe recite a poem. I am T.L. Huntington, and I'm one of 12 children, and uh, I am probably the oldest man in the house. <laughs> I I am six months past 96. And I have lived in Eddy County all of this time. And I would like to thank everybody in the house for voting for my grandson for sheriff. <laughs> history of my life. Here I stand at the foot of the stairs wearing a puzzling frown. Was I going up for something or have I just come down? I have a little trouble with my memory now and then. I don't know where I'm going and I don't know where I've been. If I lose something or other, regardless of what it costs, I never found it. I can't recall just what it was I lost. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing and I don't know what I've done. If I could remember the number, I'd call 911. <laughs> when I was a little boy a long time ago, I liked to go to the picture show and see Tom Mix and Hoot and them, Hoppy and Debbie and Tex and Slim. There never was none of that smooch and snuff, for them kissing their horse was good enough. <laughs> but as I grew older, as most boys do, I learned a thing or two. I met a little girl named I Jean and the prettiest thing you ever seen. She taught me lots of important things about moonlight walks and wedding rings. Now, if anything in my life has to be missed, that dad burned horse is not going to get kissed. <laughs> One more. <laughs> that, that boy has a mind like a bear trap. They used to say of me, every word I saw or heard remained in memory. I knew the words to all the songs and music note for note. A treasure of poems and proverbs and jokes I could always quote. It was wonderful to know that each word that I could find in comic books or scripture would remain within my mind. I still have the bear trap mind, but to spell it differently. It's not B E A R today, it's B A R E. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.